Hey there, Louis Acabalos here. Thanks for stopping by. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to assign a role to a user in ServiceNow. Now, before we get started, if you find this tutorial helpful, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. Now let's go ahead and let's get started. All right, now to assign a role to a user, you want to place your cursor in the filter navigator and you want to type users into the input box. Next, you want to click on users in the system security group. And this is going to bring up a full list of users in your ServiceNow instance. Now it's really important to note that you must have system admin permissions in order to access the user table. Now you want to find the user that you would like to assign a role to. In this case, I will just click on a random user here. And this is going to bring you into the user record. Next, you want to click on the roles tab. Now, if this user had any roles assigned to them, you would see those roles listed here. Now you can see that this user does not have any roles assigned to them currently. So I'm going to click on the edit button. And this is where you can actually come to select the specific roles that you want to assign to the user. Now you can search through the roles that exist in your ServiceNow instance by placing your cursor in this collection field and searching for the specific role that you would like to assign. Now I will assign this user the ITIL role. So you can see I just typed ITIL in this input box. Next, I'm going to select that role from the collection menu here. You can see that I've selected it. And next I'm going to click on this arrow to add the role to the user record. Now you can see here that this role has been added. And if you wanted to remove a role from the user's profile, then you would just remove it by clicking on the arrow. Now you can see that it has been removed from this role list associated with the user that you're editing. Now I'll just add the role back by pressing on the arrow. And when you're ready to commit your changes, you want to click on the save button. And you can see here the messages at the top of the screen that state that the roles are being added to this user. Now the ITIL role is composed of multiple different roles. And so you can see now when I scroll down that just by assigning that one role to this user, they've actually inherited 35 different roles. And you can see here the names of those roles on the role tab of the user record. And so that's it. In this tutorial, I demonstrated how you can assign a role to a user in ServiceNow. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. I'm Louis Acabalas. Thanks for stopping by. Talk soon.